dudes. Yeah, um, bunch of Xanadus in here. Yeah, Jerry King Xanadu. Yeah, he um, is the Xanadu. Yeah. And the Brig is uh, also a very notable Xanadu. Yes. He actually made uh, the top eight of the Xanadu Championship That's Series. That's right, the XES. Yep, yep. Yeah. So uh, clearly a veteran of Xanadu in general. Yeah, the Brig, um, I'm trying to think of better Falcons in the region. Thumbs way up. Thumbs doesn't really play anymore. You Who know. hasn't entered in a... A long time. At, at that point, we might as well mention G regulate. You know what I mean? <laughs> like it's. <laughs> I see Seb at fests. I I don't see. Uh, I don't see. Yeah, G he lives further than than Thumbs. To be fair. Okay. He okay. lives a lot further than Thumbs. Uh, but yeah. Uh, regardless, that's that's part of why MDVA very commonly, very well known fact. MDVA tends to have a little bit of a falcon problem. Yeah, we problem. get a falcon slain. Yeah. yeah. Except for the foxes who randomly figured out the matchup. You mean Cypher and Siren? Me. You just, you just see me beat none and Wizzy? You, you, know, you know who I am, Jorge? Do you know who I am, Jorge? I meant me. <laughs> I didn't mean whoever the hell you ever just mentioned. No, don't, don't mention Siren. <laughs> don't mention Siren around me. <laughs> I meant me. I meant me. But for real, I like, just, I'm <laughs> I'm mega BM'd you. The worst part is that it was genuine, you know, because like, yeah. I didn't even know. Did I, you not know that I bopped Nun and Wizzy in the same year when? after losing to Dunk? When that that year you lost to no, that, I lost it. It was within the same. So I lost to Dunk in 2015, and then I beat Wizzy and Nun both 2-0, mind you, in 2016. 2016. Yeah. Oh, you lost to Dunk at Genesis or Smash? Uh, no, it was Paragon. Paragon LA. Oh, long okay. time ago. Um, and then I beat e uh, Wizzy at Evo, and I beat none at Big House, <laughs> which are super majors. So they weren't no bullshit BS wins. <laughs> they weren't no BS wins. Let me let me say that. Hey, buddy, I'm so sorry. But, uh, <laughs> no, you're good. I, I shouldn't even be talking about this. But the Brig, the brig. all of a sudden, with a lead here on Jerry, uh -huh, uh -huh. and apparently MDVA does still have a Falcon problem because the Brig... The the most likely person to win any given Xanadu, Jerry, is currently losing to the Brig. Yes. However, in that championship series that you were talking about, where Brig was in the top eight, Jerry, the favorite to win with an overwhelming amount of uh, pro uh, yeah, he had won like, like five points. weeks in a row before that, too. Yeah, like you just needed a certain number of points to be in, and he, everyone else had like 20, 50. He had like 400 or something. He was by far the leader there and the favorite to win. Oh, but, not quite going to kill. But he makes like fourth, fourth wow. or fifth. Wow. The Brig is, came to play today. Yeah. And oh, it just gets the Ronnie and he, he, he's, he's, the he fits a taunt in taunt. there. Oh, you, you know, know what I love? Yes. That is the Isaiah. Isaiah would always do that. When he knew a knee was going to hit, he was already pressing up on his D-pad. And that is the hallmark of a Buffer good Falcon. Taunt. Buffer that taunt. Yeah. Buffer it out. Man, wow. So the Brig, and you know, Falcon, very explosive punish on Puff. Mm -hmm. um, if you can open her up, um, get a lot of up airs at the lower percent, yeah. string, uh, linking into that, that fat knee. Yeah. The, I think uh, watching HBox play a lot of top Falcons over the past few years, you might start to assume that, that Puff just runs away with this matchup. But if you watch Wizzy specifically oh, against yeah. HBox this year, oh, yeah. you see that Falcon actually has a lot of options against Puff. And didn't S2J go to game five with Hungrybox he did. recently? Yeah. He did, yeah. yeah. So, uh, oh, uh, and the Brig yeah. overextending a little bit there. SD. And the Brig also definitely a cool guy. He, uh, he, wants, to, he wants to swag a bit. I mean, there's not that many Falcon players that are not cool guys. Let's be real here. I, I think there's some. Um, the Brig is puts an puts a, a notable oh. effort. Okay, all right. Oh. Okay, I respect the wall jump, yeah, even though I don't think that has ever worked in the history of man. I res he was trying something. <laughs> yeah. Okay. I don't I like, think I, like I don't the think that that's ever worked for Falcon. It's a good hustle. Uh, you know is, what? Could this be an Try Icarus situation? He's flying a bit too close to the sun. Yeah. And doesn't need that for some reason. Show me a move. Okay, he's a cool guy. He's a cool wow. guy. Wow. And Jerry on? with no facial expression but, uh, change. That's also a Jerry classic. <laughs> that is the Jerry classic. That's a Brig and Jerry classic. Is yeah. the Brig pivot taunts and Jerry does nothing. Oh, wow. Okay. I'm pretty sure he could have just need directly from the down throw. Yeah. But he gets a little read and then just does it anyway. Cool oh, man. Ah, uh, gets the off the top, too. All right. It's the looking Brig. like a game three right now. I. <sighs> You're so down, Brig. <laughs> Brig, you're so down. Please don't. Yeah. 
you okay. gotta respect it. You I, gotta respect I it. I do because I've seen him with a lead on like I saw him Falcon punch an Icy's twice in oh. one set. Oh my! This guy, <laughs> this guy really wants did. to. This, this guy wants to style. Yeah. Uh, nice triple up he's, tilt. He's for it. <laughs> Even when he's the underdog up against the Xanadu. Uh, the Xanadu. The Xanadu. The Xanadu. He's Jerry. taunting two stocks down. Yeah. Um, and Jerry kind of, you know what? Um, as much stacked out of state representation as we have at this event, we don't have that much really strong MDVA representation. It's true. And Jerry is kind of our shining hope for it's this true. event. Yeah, so. we're just really hoping. Yeah, not very much you know what uh, I mean? Virginia it's coming out. Not a lot. Uh, I know there's a lot of stuff going on. I know Junebug had like a midterm. Yeah, he's, he's Zane in is just now. taking a break, which is fair because Zane's been grinding tourneys. Yeah, you know, do for not so check long. out Zane's stream. Because uh, <laughs> oh. I think he's like, I think he might be streaming or something. Okay, well, regardless. Lod is in med school. Yeah, Lod moved to Polish Pennsylvania. no longer lives here. Yeah, Rishi no longer lives here. I'm commentating. Milkman is in Richmond. That's so far, actually. For anyone who tries to give Richmond people crap for not coming to Xanadu, it's like a three-hour ah. three hour drive with traffic. Yeah, At minimum. Yeah, it's true. Minimum. Uh, yeah, on a weekend, it's three hours, but they cannot make it to a local. On oh, a, yeah, yeah. To a we local. The weeklies are damn near impossible for them because they have to. If they're going to go to a weekly, they have to leave at, like, noon. <laughs> yes, literally, literally, because yeah. the traffic on 495. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. So, oh, man, and uh, this is suddenly becoming a super one-sided match in Jerry's favor. Yeah, I think if the break. Ooh. If I'm the break, got to center ourselves, right? You know, tr try to make what happened in game one happen again. Um, but, you know, also also a little bit more difficult because Jerry's more aware. He's woken up knowing that, he's, uh, that he was a game down. Um, I mean, it's really so hard for the break to navigate this neutral here, especially Jerry's got him in the corner. Gives him a little bit of stage. Off the top? Nah, okay. Yeah. Um, so, Greg looking for an opening. He's at that percent where not much is going to link unless he gets a grab. Yeah. And this is dangerously close to being a four stock to one lead. Oh, oh he's sick. Man. He's sick. What a dope player. A, a fool, but he's sick. Oh, the biggest fool. <laughs> the dopest fool. Oh, <laughs> he oh, thoughts again. All right, Briggs just having fun now. Yeah. I don't know. I, I feel like he's he's personally given up hope of winning this match. <laughs> yeah, OK, OK. But you know what? That that game one was amazing. Great showing for the Briggs. He's really, I think, between game two and game three, if you really want to win, you got to take a moment. Yeah. 